Hello friends, welcome back to All in Law. This is a quick OBGYN. And today I'm going to talk about normal pregnancy events second trimester. Okay, what are the changes that takes place in the second trimester and what's the second trimester? To consider second trimester, for example, if we consider a 40 weeks of total pregnancy, if you consider to total week of 40 weeks of pregnancy, that's normal term pregnancy, uh, what do you call it? 40 weeks of pregnancy, the second trimester extends from 13 weeks, okay, to what do you call it, 26 weeks, 13 weeks to 26 weeks. Okay, the normal symptoms are uh, an improved feeling of uh, general well-being, okay, and uh, round ligament pain is really very important. So, in these patients, they will have round ligament pain, okay, round ligament pain, okay. And the, as the pregnancy continues during the second trimester, they will have a contraction, painless contraction known as a Braxton Braxton Hicks contraction Hicks contractions these are the painless remember these are the painless okay and low intensity and they have a long duration that can be palpated uh, as early as what you call a 14 weeks so it's just at the initiation of uh, what you call a second trimester you can feel the Braxton Hicks contraction they should not be confused with the labor, okay, labor pains. The other important thing that takes place during this trimester is a quickening. What's a quickening is nothing but quickening. Is the maternal awareness of the fetal movements. So mother starts feeling the baby is moving. So you might have what you call um, heard in the movies or you might have seen the patients, right? So, it's detected around, remember the weeks, really very important, 18 to 20 weeks, okay, 18 to 20 weeks, by primary gravida and multigravida, they are very sensitive, that's why it will be lower side around 16 to 20 weeks. In a primary, it's gonna be on 18 to 20 and 16 to 20 is gonna be what you call multi, okay. So this is really very important and I forgot to tell you about the weight gain during the first trimester is a 5 to 8 pounds and average weight gain over here is 1 pound per week for after 20 weeks okay it's nothing but 1 pound okay 1 pound per week 1 pound per week after after what you call 20 weeks okay and the, what are the complications? The complications include incompetent cervix. Remember, this is really very important. The complications, like we have a complication in the first time, is the spontaneous abortion. Okay, so here we have the incompetent, incompetent cervix. Okay, this is a painless cervical dilation leading to delivery of the non viable fetus means. If this is the fetus, this is uterus, and this is uh, what you call um, cervix, okay, if this is cervix, if this is incompetent, means it moves outside, it is not able to hold the fetus, means as if the what you call valve is not tight, means the matter, whatever is present over here, it will, the risk of falling, right? So this is uh, what it happens in if there is an incompetent cervix. So premature membrane rupture can be there and the premature labor can occur. So what are the complications can occur in the second trimester is incompetent cervix. Then we have premature membrane rupture. Okay. And the third one is a premature labor. Okay guys. So these are the complications. You should know the complications also because in USMLA they will ask you about the complications expected in this patient during her 18 weeks, 20 weeks, blah, 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 okay? So thank you so much for watching this video. Take care.